Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Romans chapter 2, beginning at verse 17 and ending at verse 29. This is the Amplified Version. The Jew is condemned by the law. But if you bear the name Jew and rely on the law for your salvation and boast in your special relationship to God, and if you claim to know his will and approve the things that are essential or have a sense of what is excellent based on your instruction from the law, and if you are confident that you are a qualified guide to the blind, those untaught in theology, a light to those who are in darkness, and that you are a corrector of the foolish, a teacher of the spiritually childish, having in the law the embodiment of knowledge and of the truth. Well then, you who teach others, do you not teach yourself? You who preach against stealing, do you steal in ways that are discreet, but just as sinful? You who say that one must not commit adultery, do you commit adultery? You who detest idols, do you rob pagan temples of valuable idols and offerings? You who boast in the law, do you repeatedly dishonor God by breaking the law? For the name of God is blasphemed among the Gentiles because of you, just as it is written in Scripture. Circumcision, the sign of the covenant of Abraham, is indeed of value if you practice the law. But if you habitually break the law, your circumcision has become uncircumcision. It is meaningless in God's sight. So if the uncircumcised man keeps the requirements of the law, will not his uncircumcision be regarded by God as circumcision? Then he who is physically uncircumcised, but keeps the spirit of the law, will judge you, who even though you have the written code and circumcision, break the law. For he is not a real Jew, who is only one outwardly, nor is true circumcision something external and physical. But he is a Jew who is one inwardly, and true circumcision is circumcision of the heart, by the spirit, not by the fulfillment of the letter of the law. His praise is not from men, but from God. The end. God bless you, and thank you for joining me today.